Hi everybody, I'm Melissa. Welcome to Clad Mom. This is month 31 with your toddler and with my toddler, Bracey. The Bracey update. Bracey had a wonderful 31st month. He had fun playing outside. The weather got better. He had fun playing inside. And generally, he's just been a delight. We've noticed him talking more, which is wonderful to see, especially given how premature he was. Thank you. What's typical for a 31-month-old when it comes to speech and language? By this age, most toddlers can say 50 to 100 words. Some toddlers are saying more by this point. Keep in mind that there's a huge range of normal with some toddlers saying fewer words and some saying more. Utter two to four word phrases, including an action word like George fall. Use the past tense like George fell. Point to basic things in a book when you read it and name them like horse, cow, sun, tree, cake. Sing a truncated version of a song like Happy Birthday. <laughs> Pronounce the names of an increasing amount of family members and friends with consonants, such as in our case, we've heard Bracey say very nicely, Beckett. <laughs> How can I teach my toddler to speak? By this point, try to engage in regular conversations with your toddler. Is that yummy? Yummy? Yeah. More? Ask them what they did. Ask them what they would like to do, giving them a choice so that you avoid the no that can result from a yes or no question. Ask them what they're eating. Ask them what they would like to listen to when it comes to a song and try to react when you ask your toddler a question, try to focus on them, make eye to eye contact, respond to them. This is a great way to start to teach your child the basics of polite conversation. And the language practice is great for them and it's also emotionally very good for them to see that they're developing this more mature relationship with you where they are really starting to communicate as a more grown up person. They will like that very, very much. Whenever you can, my joke about this is give your child a choice over small things that don't matter. What book to read, what vegetable to eat, what fruit to opt for, what to play at the playground. It doesn't matter because either choice is great. It gives them a sense of autonomy, confidence, and independence. And in my view, it will lessen the amount of tantrums that will happen because they will feel more control. Physical development for a 31-month-old toddler. At this point, your toddler should be getting stronger, more agile, and better at doing simple things like climbing up and down stairs at home, rolling around on the floor, getting on and off the sofa, jumping, dancing, outside, running, jogging, going up the play gym, going down the slide, going on the seesaw. All of these activities are great for your toddler. Try to get outside at least an hour a day, if not more. When you're home, try to keep your toddler moving. Do not put your toddler in front of the TV, the iPhone, a telephone, if you can help it. Try really, really, really hard not to do it. It's not as good for them as it is to be out in the world actively learning things and moving their young bodies. Intellectual activities for a 31-month-old toddler. At this point, you might see your toddler engaging in creative play. I've noticed this with Bracey over the past month. He started to take cars and horses and interact with them using his imagination. Encourage this. It's an important part of your toddler's cognitive development, experts say, and how they digest what's happening in the world and play it out so that they learn how things work. So their horse might be having a meal or he might be having water. Or he might be taking a little ride around somewhere or he might be running around somewhere. These are all very normal things. It's a way your toddler is processing information and learning things. And of course, we all know that the imagination is really important because this will allow your toddler to continue to be creative as they grow up, which is a very important thing. Why does my toddler play alone? Experts say it's actually very normal for children this age to play on their own. They say that toddlers don't often interact when they play at this stage, but that comes a bit later. That being said, if you notice your toddler not making eye contact, not relating to other people, not seeming to engage with them or laugh or play or smile when he sees them, and you notice what looks like antisocial behavior, definitely discuss this with your doctor. Find motor activities for a 31-month-old toddler, small blocks, magnet-type blocks, plastic chain links, Play-Doh, finger painting, or activity sets with zippers, buttons, and Velcro 
Oversized Legos, all of these activities are super for a toddler this age. Try to be there while your toddler plays some of the time and to say aloud the numbers, colors, and concepts involved so that playing also becomes language rich. What should my 31-month-old toddler be eating? Keep it fresh, keep it varied, include all the different food groups, give enough dairy, give enough protein, don't stress too much on a daily basis, but look at what your toddler's eating over the course of a week. And as my doctors always told me, introduce, introduce, introduce. If they don't like it, keep putting it out there. They don't like vegetables, keep putting them out there. They don't like fruits, keep putting them out there. And over time, they hopefully will begin to eat them. If you notice that your child is an extremely picky eater and is not getting his or her basic nutrients, definitely talk to your pediatrician because your child needs those nutrients and see what he says and come up with a plan. What is my schedule for breastfeeding or milk feeding a toddler at 31 months of age? Your toddler will need about 12.5 to 14 hours of sleep over a 24 hour period. That means 11 to 12 hours at night and a 1.5 to three hour nap. Bracey sleeps 13 to 15 hours a day, 11 to 12 hours at night with a nap of around two to three hours. 7 a.m. breastfeed or give breakfast and then milk or its equivalent. 10 a.m. snack. 12 p.m. feed and lunch, then have a nap. 3 p.m. breastfeed your baby, then give a snack. Maybe it's dairy-rich, protein-rich. Dinner is at around 6.30 p.m. At 7.30 p.m., try to do a final milk feeding. And at 8 p.m., that's bedtime. My toddler is climbing out of his crib. Welcome to my world. This happened last month with Bracey. I was not happy. I was bummed out. What do you do? Well, it's time to look for a toddler bed because it's not safe for your toddler to be climbing in and out of his crib. You don't want them to hit their head or get hurt or anything like that. And it's kind of a scary thing because it is true that sleep training now becomes a little more difficult because your toddler could just be like running in and out of there. What you want to do, in my experience, is practice the same good habits that you always have. If your toddler runs out of his toddler crib, it's a kiss and back to night night and just keep doing it. Don't make it playtime. Don't make it fun time. Don't start dancing or watching TV or watching a movie or introducing a new toy. Nope. It's night night. Try to stay firm, stay loving, give your toddler a hug and a kiss and it's back in the bed. And over time, they will get worn down. They will get tired and they will go to sleep. This to me is the best way to sleep train a toddler Best of luck finding your toddler's new bed, and they might feel very grown up and important once they get to sleep in that, and you might find that they actually even like it. What is the average weight and height of a 31-month-old toddler? The average weight for a 31-month-old toddler is 30.2 pounds for boys, which is 13.7 kilos, and 29.1 pounds, which is 13.2 kilos for girls. How tall is the average 31-month-old? The average height for a 31-month-old boy is 36.2 inches, which is 92 centimeters, and for a girl is 35.8 inches, which is 91 centimeters. I'm wishing all of you guys the best of luck with your babies and toddlers. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you back very soon on cloudmom.com.